Uh, we arrived in this country on the end of 2007, and the last five years, we tried to uh, decentralize care from the main health facilities to the primary health care facilities, so to be able the people to have better access to the to the most most needed antiretroviral treatment. Now we can say we can dream of moving on in the next step of controlling the epidemic. We are in a mature level of, of this intervention and in this level we can go to curb the epidemic. And the next step, of course, is the new approaches, the new innovative approaches from the international community, that is the treatment as prevention approaches. The basic from them, the first one that we start is pregnant woman. Okay, in 2013, it's quite criminal to have transmission of the, to, of the virus from the mother to the child. It's essential to stop, 100% to stop, this transmission. The next step, after a few months, we want to offer to all HIV-positive adults of Hlangano area to offer a, a access to antiretroviral treatment without any check, without any CD4 count, any other uh, things, only proper monitoring. We have more and more evidence from the international community that giving earlier, as earlier as possible, a starting treatment of HIV, you have much better results for the life of the patient, for the different infections that can have during his life course. I can say that we have very good relations with Ministry of Health. We work inside Ministry of Health facilities. We work inside the health system, and this is an essential part in our work with HIV AIDS because we need to care about the continuity of our action. So moving forward uh, to option B plus uh, is very critical and crucial for the country. It's going to be able to help uh, the children, the babies to be born HIV free and also having the mother to survive. I think the challenge now since it's new is a matter of seeing how are the Swazi people responding to this initiative and how is it acceptable to the Swazi people and the, the cost implication uh, that will come up with this initiative. This is really a pilot project that also will help even the whole country and influence the whole policy of the country. And we hope that this initiative will not only help Swaziland, but even other countries then can come and learn. We are here to give example. We are here to be catalysts for change for Ministry of Health and for the other actors. So to be able to ensure that when we are out, we'll continue essential antiretroviral treatment for the population of Swaziland to be able to roll out in the rest of the country according to the example of Siselweni.